Welcome into Buckspeed presented by Advent Health. The Dolphins came in town a few days early to get in two joint practices before the first preseason game on Saturday, and Coach Bowles was asked about facing this new look Dolphins offense. Now we knew they got, they had a heck of a running game. We knew that from San Francisco. Mike's a heck of a run game coordinator, and they can put things together. We know they got a lot of speed outside, and nobody's really showing anything. So from a work standpoint, it was good to get the work against a different offense. Like we see different blocking. They have different runs than what we see in practice. So the work was great. I don't think they showed us everything, nor did we show them everything. On Tuesday, the Bucks hosted a Women of Red Day at camp, welcoming the Women of Red fan club that promotes camaraderie and community with women who love football. And it included an opportunity for fans to take photos and receive autographs from some Bucks legends. Also on Tuesday, the team hosted the 2022 Boys High School Football Media Day. This event welcomed 34 teams from Hillsborough County and over 200 athletes to Raymond James Stadium for photo opportunities and to be showcased on live television to answer questions from the media about their upcoming football season. Stay tuned for all the coverage of the rest of training camp and the first preseason game right here on Buccaneers.com.